Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome. It is our pleasure to present to you the 2008 Miss California USA and Miss California Teen USA pageants. Tonight, two young women will move on to compete for the title of Miss USA and Miss Teen USA. Now, please welcome your 2008 contestants in the opening presentation. Ladies and gentlemen, we welcome our team contestants. Now, ladies and gentlemen, please, let's introduce our first group of contestants of the team division. Charity Ruin, 16, Elisa Viejo. Bianca Mettler, 15, Arroyo Grande. Jeanette Pineda, 17, Artesia. Lauren Borba, 16, Bay Area. Kelsey Gilligan, 16, Beaumont. Natasha Winnick, 16, Burbank. Brittany Chen, 16, Cerritos. Ashley Dutton, 17, Chino Hill. Greater Oxnard. <laughs> Kelly Snyder, 18, Greater San Diego. <laughs> Greer Grammar, 15, Malibu. Kelsey Wass, 17, Mariloma. Amanda Delgado, 18, Mojave Valley. Lauren Pacheco, 17, Monterey County. Linnea Duncan, 16, Marietta Valley. Cooper New, 16, Napa County. Taylor Goss, 17, Norco. Ava McLeod, 17, Oakland. And now, please welcome the second group of contestants for Miss California Teen USA. Let's welcome our contestants for the second group of teen contestants as they introduce themselves. Corbin Beardsley, 18, Orange County. Melanie Ulasic, 16, 
Rancho Bernardo. Jacqueline Rafalovich, 17, Rancho Santa Fe. Nina Tyler, 17, Riverside County. <laughs> Tiffany Gaines, 15, San Bernardino. Sarah Burns, 16, San Clemente. Margaret Miranda, 17, San Francisco. Lisa Fay, 17, San Jose. Bar Hajion, 16, San Ramon Valley. Jessica Parrington, 16, Santa Clarita. Kylie Kaczynski, 15, Santa Cruz. Kimberly Bebo, 15, Simi Valley. Irene Bautista, 17, Solano County. Lexi Guerrero, 17, Temecula. Jocelyn Frank Husen, 17, Valencia. Taylor Atkins, 16, Ventura County. <laughs> Brittany Wagner, 19, Victorville. Jenna Mitchell. Jenna Mitchell, 18, Westlake Village. Jennifer Lija, 17, Ukaipa. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the reigning Miss Teen California, Kylie Lynn. And now, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the Miss California contestant. title of Miss California, USA 2008. Bridget DeCaro, 24 at Ranch. Stephanie, Stephanie Teal, 21, Alameda County. Sarah Chapman, 23, Almaden Valley. <laughs> Ashley McCurdy, 20, Anaheim. <laughs> Raquel Beasley, 21, Barso. Anne Marie Ashley, 21, Bel Air. <laughs> Betty Sue, 25, Berkeley. Amber Kaufman, 25, Brentwood. 
Lizette Maricela Castro, 24, Burbank. Sierra Gallegos, 19, Camarillo. Erica Spencer, 21, Century City. Michelle Vinay, 24, Chico. Alondra Garcia, 25, Chula Vista. Amanda Cochran, 21, Citrus Valley. Culver City. Bernice Wilson, 24, Diamond Bar. Joyce Cochin, 19, Dublin. Let's meet our second group of contestants. Miss California 2008. Claudia Manassas, 23, Encino. Shelby Waldner, 22, Folsom. Jennifer Badger, 24, Garden Grove. Cassandra Chase, 26, Greater Lakewood. Amanda Sue Holton, 25, Hollywood. Lula Mae Robinson, 21, Humboldt County. <laughs> Katie Vesterbrucci, 26, La Jolla. <laughs> Christina Johnson, 24, La Mesa. Josephine Lane, 19, Laguna Hills. Parisa Hanakar, 22, Laguna Miguel. <laughs> Jessica Walchak, 23, Long Beach. <laughs> Ashley Phelps, 20, Mission Beach. <laughs> Jacqueline Williams, 19, Los Gatos. Nana Merriweather, 22, Malibu. <laughs> Erica Renee Johnson, 26, Mid Wilshire. <laughs> Christina Silva, 24, Los Angeles. <laughs> Rocio Macia, 24, Mission Viejo. Kristen Schwann, 19, more part. <laughs> Roxanne Bixler, 24, Northridge. Ariana Kurtick, 22, Orange County.
And now, ladies and gentlemen, let's meet our third group of contestants, all vying for the title of Miss California 2008. Lacey Wilson, 23, Pacific Heights. Kenny Andrade, 21, Pacific Palisades. Jessica Morgan, 21, Palo Verde Ranch. Stephanie Nelson, 22, Palmdale. Caitlin O'Connor, 18, Palms. Nicole Chu, 24, Palos Verdes. Megan Bushel, 25, Paradise Cove. Teresa Nicola, 24, Park La Brea. Nohea Marlowe, 21, Pasadena. Christy Kelly, 23, Pebble Beach. Stephanie Clark, 25, Playa Del Rey. Mickey Lou, 19, Pleasanton. Kelly Smith, 22, Quartz Hill. Jessica Estrada, 26, Rancho Cucamonga. Shalomar De Los Reyes, 26, Rancho Penasquito. Janae Gaucher, 24, Rancho Santa Margarita. Lauren Oliver, 23, Redland. Marion Cabell, 21, San Bernardino. Candace Nicholson, 23, San Fernando Valley. Carol Chen, 25, San Francisco. Miriam Lang, 25, San Gabriel Valley. Sparkle Joy Williams, 23, San Jose. Let's meet our last group of contestants. Miss California 2008. Natalie Gomez, 25, Santa Clara County. Ashley Newton, 22, Santa Clarita. Margarita Cordova, 23, Santa Monica. Adrian Lopez, 23, Sherman Oaks. Soroka, 23, Silver Lake. Mason Hathorne, 18, Simi Valley. Ashton Packer, 19, Solano County. I am Jordan Taylor, 24, South Bay Area, California. <laughs> Ashlyn Beardsley, 24, South Orange County. Rachel Vangel, 20, Tulare County. Casey Burns, 26, Universal City. Ariana Rodon, 20, Back of Valley. <laughs> Katrina Moreno Perez, 21, Vallejo. Lana Zunder, 21, Van Nuys. Sarah Abraham, 19, Ventura County. 
Yanitza Munoz, 20, Villa Park. Rachel Villar, 26, West Hollywood. Nicole Johnson, 22, Westlake Village. Cassandra Jean, 22, Westwood. Marlene Alvarez, 22, Whittier, California. And I am Brandy Williams, 25, from Woodland Hills. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome the reigning Miss California USA 2007, Megan Tandy. There they are, your first group of ladies. A nice round of applause. Thank you, ladies. Our second group of contestants. Miss California 2008. Thank you, ladies. Contestants. Thank you, ladies. Miss California, USA 2005. Brittany, we got to do something here. I know, that wasn't so good. You guys are about to see the finest girls that California has to offer. And, hold on, hold on. 90% of you out there were responsible for making the finest girls that California has to offer. So let's try this one more time. What's up, everybody? Okay. That was pretty good. That now I'm ready to good. go. Now I'm ready to go. So tonight, two lives will be dramatically changed forever. And when I mean forever, I mean Brittany forever. Forever. The traditions of the Miss Universe organization is a long and lustrous one filled with tradition. 
Women such as Academy Award-winning actress Halle Berry, Nancy O'Dell, Diane Sawyer, I didn't know that, mm -hmm. and Eva Longoria have all participated in events like the one here tonight that you're going to watch. So without further ado, let's begin the show. I've been dying all night to meet the contestants here tonight competing for Miss California USA and Miss Teen California USA. And ladies, please remember to come over to me so I can have all of your autographs. I need some money. Uh, wait, 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 hold eBay on. Br Br Brittany, now you know this ain't the time or place to be getting no autographs. What are you, a groupie I'm now? I'm short change right now. I'm uh, going to need to eBay some autographs. I know the recession this. is hard, but God, girl, man. Sam, don't be jealous that I'm efficient and have better time management skills than you do. Oh, whatever. Audience, are you ready to meet your semifinalists? <laughs> now... The scary part is these young women have accomplished more than most adults I know. They're some of the best and brightest our entire state has to offer. These girls are what I like to call the future. And let's not forget, they're pretty beautiful. Before we announce our top 15, I want to let all of you know how proud we are of you and how proud you should be of yourself. Good job, ladies. Let's have one more round of applause for all of our teams. Yeah. Okay, 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 okay. I can't take the suspense anymore. Are you guys ready? Y'all ready? Are you ready? Envelope, please. Oh, man. Thank you very much. Kelly loves you too, whoever said that. Okay, not that one. Okay, our first finalist for Teen USA is Ventura County Teen Taylor Atkins. Next, we have Napa County T. Cooper No. Who's ready for our fourth semifinalist? Who? Who's Come ready? on! It's Riverside Team Nina Tyler. Okay, so for lucky number five, we have. Temecula T, Lexi Guerrero! Come on down, Miss Malibu Team, Greer Grammar! Next we have Alyssa Viejo Team, Charity Rowland! Coming at you next, we have Rancho Bernardino team, Melanie Lucese. Come on down, number 10, Miss Murrieta Valley team, Linda Duncan. Come on down, Arroyo Grande team, Bianca Medela. Next, we have Mojave Valley Teen, Amanda Delgado. All right, only two spots remain. Oh, only 
two, Brent. Only two. Maybe it's for you and me. Yeah, yeah. I think. Well, we're too old for that, so right. we got to right. give it to somebody else. All right. We'll send in Miss San Ramon Valley Teen for her husband. Okay, y'all. The final spot goes to. Valencia T, Jocelyn Bencuzzini. Ladies and gentlemen, let's hear it for your semifinalists for Miss California Teen USA. This is so exciting in just a few moments. Well, okay, maybe a couple hours. One of those ladies you just saw is going to be wearing the crown, and trust me, Everyone looks better in a crowd. Wait, 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 Brittany, Brittany. You telling me that everybody looks better with a crown? Yeah. E even me? Oh, Sam, I I'm not here to chit-chat. I'm here to just find a winner. Now, may I present the ladies vying for the title of Miss California USA 2008. We just want you guys to know we're very proud of each and every one of you. And remember, you're living a dream. Let's have one more round of applause for all of our contestants, y'all. Come on. Give it up for them. Yeah. Give it up. All right. This is it. Here we go. Are y'all ready? Whew. All right. Let's do this. Our first final goes to... Rancho Cucamonga, Jessica Estrada. Where are you? Our second semifinalist comes from a city right near me, Miss La Jolla, Katie Batchelverde. Our next finalist is Pacific Heights, Lacey Ann Wilson. Come on down, Miss Pacific Palisades, Kenya Andrade. Our next finalist, come on down. Berkeley, Betty Esu. It's the moment you've been waiting for, Miss Greater San Diego, Carrie Brazil. Our next finalist, staying very local, goes to Los Angeles, Christina Silva. Next, we have Barstow, Rachel Beasley. Here she comes, Miss Salas Verde's Nickel Shoe.
your top 15 for the title of Miss California 2008. Thank you, ladies. Congratulations, ladies. walking red carpets, speaking to peers, working with charities, and attending fabulous events. Mm -hmm. And there's a lot of good fashion that goes along with that. Miss California USA will be seen on televisions around the world as she competes in the Miss USA pageant televised live on NBC. Miss Teen USA will go on to compete in the national pageant as well. That's right. Now, we have two very special women who know exactly how our top 15 feeling is now, right now. Please welcome your 2007 Miss California Teen USA and yeah. Miss California USA, Kylie Lynn and Megan Candy. Bring them out, 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 what? Woo! Hey, um, How you doing? I'm good, how are you? You feeling good? No, yeah, can you believe it? Man, you're a good. It's amazing, huh? Well, I just want to say you had an amazing year as Miss California Teen USA. So tell me what it was like and how you felt when you found out that you had made the top 15 last year. I think all of us were just excited. I mean, this is the big moment that you work for all weekend to get. I know for me, I kind of went blank and didn't realize it was my name that was called, but mostly we're all just so excited. That was great, huh? <laughs> Ooh. And as many of you know, Megan Tandy was the third runner-up to Miss USA. <laughs> wow, that is Come a on, huge accomplishment. Amazing. Megan, how did it feel to be in the top five at Miss USA? It was really weird because if any of you guys remember from last year, I actually was called last into the top five for Miss California USA. So when I got to the national level, I was like, there is no way they're calling me last. So when they got to like the third girl, I was like, okay, well, I guess I didn't make it. And then when they called the fourth girl, and then I looked around to see who else was still there, I was like, there's no way it's me. 
And then they called my name. I was like, hey. I was really excited. But it was really weird, you know. But I had so much fun. And it was kind of weird, you know, because Donald Trump's sitting there, mm -hmm. and then Paula Sugar, and you got the cameras. I know, yeah, hey, Donald, hey. But it was just kind of weird. But I honestly had an amazing time. Well, we are so, so very proud of you. It's going to be sad to see you go. So, Kylie, check this out. Since you've been through this whole thing, I just want to ask you, do you have any advice for the girls back? Because they are, I saw them backstage, and this oh. is something they'll remember forever, they're so they're kind of nervous, nervous. So give them some positive words. What would you say? I think I would just like to tell them to breathe and just to soak in every moment and go out there and shine, because I really hope they come out here with the best of memories of this night. And if they lose, they can always marry a rich guy, right? Like you, Sam. Yeah, yeah, yeah OK. All right, Everyone all right, wants all right. a Sam. Cool, cool. All right, that's good. <laughs> okay, moving on to Megan. What do the two young women who become our new title holders have to look forward in this year? Because it's a huge, crazy year. You get thrust into celebrity all of a sudden. And what do they have to look forward to? Well, besides the glitz and glam and all the material things that you get to have, um, she basically just needs to look forward to growing. Um, this year, I've just matured so much. I feel like a more wise individual. I'm way more confident. I feel more confident speaking in front of a big crowd like this. And I think she just needs to just be ready because she's going to get this big, you know, maturity boost, and it's really going to help her out. Megan. That's, That's right. Yeah. Go, Mom. <laughs> and Dad. Thank you. Well, guys, thank you so much for joining us. And it really is going to be sad to see you go. You did amazing, amazing job. You guys were amazing. You. Seriously. We hope the next winners are just like y'all and represent. <laughs> All right? We love y'all. Hey, Brittany, why are all these girls over here wearing all these swimsuits? You're not supposed to be peeking off in the back. Wait, wait, hold up. But we ain't even close to a beach or anything. Oh, my goodness. I th Security! We need. Are they trying to sneak into the hotel pool or something? Sam, calm, calm down. Come on. Look how good no, they look. No, calm down. Hey, girl, give Sam! me your number. What? <laughs> What's this? What's going They're on? They're not running away. It's time for the swimsuit competition. Oh, wait! Are you guys excited about the swimsuit competition? Okay, number one fear in America and most of the world is being on a stage in front of a lot, a lot of people. So show number them love. Number two is showing your body. They get it combined in about 20 seconds. So are you guys ready to see them? The ladies will be judged based on their overall physical fitness. So without any further delay or any hysterical outbursts. I'll try. I'll be good. I'll be good. Here. I'll be good. I'll be good. I give you the 2008 semifinalist swimsuit competition for Miss California Teen USA 2008. Yeah. 
Ventura County team. She makes me feel like I could be a tower. Big so tired. The power to be, the power to give, the power to see. Yeah, yeah. Bay Area. She got the power to be, the power to give, the power to see. Yeah, yeah.
Greater San Diego. very lovely without a doubt. This concludes the swimsuit, judging for the 2008 Miss California USA competition. But that's wrong, so we're just going to totally go wrong. back. We're having technical difficulties up here. We'll, we'll get it what together. What did you guys think about that little swimsuit competition you just saw? All right, yeah. since we're we having some technical difficulties, I can be Sam and make y'all laugh. Oh, they coming out again? Man, I can't make y'all laugh. The Miss Division are coming out, so I'll make y'all laugh later on. All right, so here we All go. All right, so let's put our hands together again and welcome Miss California USA 2008 contestants in the swimsuit competition. Give it up, guys. Her face is a map of the world, is a map of the world. You can see she's a beautiful girl, she's a beautiful girl. And everything. Silver pool of light People who surround her Feel the benefit of it It makes you count She holds you Captivated in her power Suddenly I
this evening with Rancho Cucamonga. And she's taller than most And she's looking at me I can see her eyes looking from the page of a magazine She makes me feel like I could be a tower Big song tower, yeah The power to be, the power to give The power to see, yeah, yeah She got the power to be, the power to give The power to see, yeah, yeah La Joya. Pacific Heights. This is a correction. This is Pacific Heights, ladies and gentlemen. Pacific Heights. Thank you. She's a beautiful girl And everything around her is a silver pool of light People who surround her feel the benefit of it It makes you count She holds you captivated in her power Suddenly I see This is what I want to be Suddenly I see This is what I want to be, suddenly I see, suddenly I see, why the hell it means so much to me. And I feel like walking the world, like walking the world, and you can hear she's a beautiful girl, she's a beautiful girl, she fills up there. Raiders, San Diego. Trying to remember what you're. She likes to leave you hanging on a word. Suddenly I see. This is what I want to be. Suddenly I see. Why the hell it means so much to me. But this is what I want to be. Suddenly I see. Why the hell it means so much. Los Angeles. And she's looking at me. I can see her eyes looking from the page of a magazine. She makes me feel like I could be a tower. Big strong tower, yeah. The power to be, the power to give, the power to see, yeah, yeah. She got the power to be, the power to give, the power to see, yeah, yeah. She got the power to be, the power to give, the power to see, yeah, yeah. She got the power to be, the power to give, the power to see, yeah, yeah. Oh, 
Holy Spirit. She makes me feel like I could be a tower, big strong tower, yeah. The power to be, the power to give, the power to see, yeah, yeah. Bernardino. are so lovely without a doubt so that concludes the swimsuit judging for the 2008 Miss California USA competition thank you very much ladies can we give it up for them one more time man they look smoking hot hot it is what it is it is what it is now it's time to get to know our panel of judges as you can see our judges tonight have a very difficult decision to make and I am very very glad that I'm a host and I didn't have to be a judge because when you got that many fine women it's like mm -hmm. you just start seeing you get blind and all kind of stuff starts going on in your head that's so enough that's enough there's just too many at let's one time. begin with Annie Roberts Annie can you stand for us Annie, Annie has been the casting director for both E Entertainment Television as well as the Style Network she has been responsible for casting 100 episodic pilot shows throughout her notable career. That means we need to like get her number because she could give me a new a job. We're a package Annie, deal. Annie, hook this up. You know, after this, we need another job. 
Next, we have Ty Griffin. He's a reality television show producer, and he's worked on such great shows as America's Top Model with Tyra Banks. He's also helped launch the popular, very popular Apprentice reality show on NBC. Give it up. <laughs> Ty, since you did The Apprentice, holla at your boy Donald Trump, because, you know, I need some money. The economy is bad right now, so look out for me, all right? Dono, where you at? Samara Billick is a seasoned casting director working in Los Angeles. Her credits include the hit TV series Married with Children, as well as the Emmy Award winning Ellen. I love that lady. She is currently working on ABC's Samantha Who. That's right. <laughs> Dr. Alexander Rifkin, cosmetic surgeon and UCLA faculty, is recognized as the first doctor in our nation to offer a non-surgical nose job. Wow, That's okay. impressive. That's real That's cool. That's very impressive. His unique and widely popular procedure has been featured on such great shows as Extra, The Tyra Banks Show, and The Today Show. So any of you ladies that need to be fixed up and, you know, go to that next level, highlight my man. Where I, you at? I Give just want to know him. how you do a non-surgical nose job. Non-surgical, You're going to show me huh? later? Okay. You must make a lot of money too, huh? You're going That's to be, pass, gonna be passing out a lot of cards. You can through. ignore him. Okay, all right. Miss beautiful Katie Blair, for all of you who have been watching Pageant Place. That's is right. Miss Teen USA 2006. She is now a very successful print and runway model who has been featured on her very own billboard in New York City's infamous Times Square. Wow. I'm impressed with that, too. Give where you at, girl. Katie Blair. Ash Gupta is an internationally respected photographer. He has photographed such celebrities as Elizabeth Shue, Sharon Lee, and Dominique Swain. Please give it up. Where you at, Ash? Give it up for Ash. OK, I apologize in advance, because I'm going to probably slaughter the next name. Wow, wait, hold on. This is a hard, I'm going to try and help you. Lelane. Where you at, Lelane? Lelane Did I get it? Lelane Stiglain? Lelane Stiglain is a successful Canadian model. Good friend of mine. Good friend of mine. We go way back. Oh, yes. Superstar. You may recognize her as Smiley on VH1's Charm School, where she took second place and made it to the very end of the season. Congratulations. That's right. Now, this next young man is very special. You know, I'm the kind of guy that if somebody's talented and they're a good-looking guy, I got to give it up. I'm never a hater. I'm happy for everybody. So this, they brought this guy for the ladies. He's an accomplished actor, Randy Wayne, Luke Duke, and the up-and-coming Dukes of Hazzard 2. His extensive credits include shows as Jack and Bobby, Huff, and Navy and CIS. Please give wow. it up for Randy Wayne. Where you at, Randy? Randy's got a girl, so all you girls, I, I don't, you have he's no taken. chance. Yeah, he's taken. <laughs> this next one, I like her last name, Francine Champagne, a recognized leader in the entertainment industry, is the active president of Vision Model Management. She spent many years working as the director of bookings for Elite, one of the most recognizable firms in the world. Give it up. We've got an amazing panel here. Man, I'm so excited because I know after this, like, we got another job. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? So a few jobs. In yeah, there. we got a few Getting jobs my nose in there. Job, you know, and then it's a hard time. Times so look out for me and my girl right stuff. here. You know, recession's bad. <laughs> Next person, Rick Enrique, is a senior vice president and the head of development for Shankly Productions. He has produced several high-profile shows, including Charm School. I love New York and the pilot for America's Smartest Model, so he can again give us a job. Give it up for him, y'all. <laughs> I love it. I'm going to be working after this. We're going to be working. We would like to thank all of our judges this evening for being here for this most important event for the state of California. That's right. Let's have one more round of applause for all of them. Yes. All right. We've been waiting for this. Let's bring back all of our team semifinalists for the announcement of our top 10. Yeah. Oh, man. Thank you. If 
feels like we just got here. Are you guys ready to narrow it down to top 10? Okay. Oh, I, I think I'm kind of feeling a little bit hungry, so maybe we'll just take a two-hour intermission, get a little dinner. Yeah, yeah, no, that sounds cool. What, what chicken, ribs, what? I'm hungry, no, I'm too. I'm for sushi. Sushi? I want Roscoe's chicken and waffles. How many of y'all like Roscoe's? At? I know you know about Roscoe's, girl. Yeah, that's right. Roscoe's! I can't afford all that sushi stuff. Women are expensive these days. I got to have five jobs just to keep a girlfriend. I swear, man. That's Which is real. why we need to talk with some of these judges after. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because they're not going to have three or four jobs. Well, guess what? I know who makes top ten and you don't yet. All right. I've wanted to say that for so long. Yes. Are you guys ready? Our first finalist for the title. Oh, wait. Before I go any further, just so you know, no particular order. No particular order, it That's doesn't right. mean anything. They're we not just, being called in one order for any reason at all. We're just giving names, all right? No order, we're just giving names. Names, that's what we were brought here to Finalist do. Finalist number one is, let's get over there. Yeah, yeah, let's get out of their way. This is their moment, this it's about them. Time. Miss Ventura County Team. Yeah! Next, we have Miss Bay Area T. Yay, yay! Our number three is Miss Napa County T. Give it up, y'all, give it up! Next, we have Miss Riverside T. We're halfway there when we call Miss Temecula Team. Where you at? Coming right up, we have Miss Malibu Team. Malibu. Here we go, Miss Beaumont Team. I know you like this one, Brent. Next, we have Miss Greater San Diego Team. Only two left. Who will she be? Miss Mojave Valley Team. Now, for our final spot, we have Miss San Ramon Valley Team! Woo! There they are, ladies and gentlemen, your top 10 Miss Teen California 2008 contestants. Thank you, ladies. going to be. Can you? Nah, I can't tell either. I have no a idea. A good group. All right, let's continue by bringing back our Miss California semifinalists for the announcement of the top 10. <laughs> Woo! As we build the suspense, Britt. Oof, oh, it's getting man. pretty intense. I love this, like, because I control their destiny right now. So it's like a good feeling, you know what I mean? I mean, can't you feel the energy? Can't you feel the suspense? Can't you feel like their lives are about to change just because of me? And can't you just feel like something's about okay, that's to change? What, 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 what? Anymore. Goodness gracious. I'm just asking them if they can Our first finalist for Miss California USA 2008 is, I wish I would have studied there. Come on down, Berkeley. Yeah. Where you at, Berkeley? You're supposed to be the smart one. <laughs> come on now, girl, come on! Our next 
finalist is Miss Greater San Diego. Here she is, Miss Los Angeles. Coming right up, we have Miss Barstow. Yeah, Barstow in the house. Here we go. Halfway there with Palos Verdes. Ranch. Next, we have my hometown, my hometown, Miss Woodland Hills. Next, we have Miss Mission Beach. Here she comes, Miss Palo Verde Ranch. Yeah! Next, we have Miss Almeida. And bringing it all home is Miss there they are, your 10 finalists for the title of Miss California, USA 2008. Thank you, ladies. Yeah! These contestants are one step closer to becoming Miss California 2008. Thank you, ladies. Woo! Thank you. Before we continue, I gotta say, are they doing a great job or what? Can we give it up for them? Wait, wait, Brittany. Yes. I, I think we forgot to do something really important. What? Huh? Yeah, yeah, are you we did. Me? Uh huh. We forgot to do something really important. What? Sam, we, what did we forget? We forgot to do something really, really, really important. Oh, we forgot to Tebow America's Next Top Model. Oh yeah, 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 yeah that too. But I think we should announce to our audience how our prelims were judged for our semifinalists. That's tonight. important. I, that, that's important. You're, you're right. Because a lot of stuff happened before these girls got here, so I think we need to break that down to them. Good idea. All right. Okay, so on Friday, all 128 contestants competed in the preliminary swimsuit and evening gown competition. Then, all, then on Saturday, all the contestants had personal interviews with our judges so we could know more about them and see their speaking abilities, and find out if, like me, they had, like, wonderful personalities. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? We had to make sure that they were cool, right, Brett? Yes. Okay, the score from the preliminary swimsuit, evening gown, and personal interview were combined to select the top 15 that you saw come out here. Tonight, the scores have been cleared completely, and the top 15 are scored once again on a clean slate. That's right, clean slate it is. Miss California organization follows the same competition format as Miss USA, Miss Teen USA, and Miss Universe pageant. So we're doing big things up here, okay? Mm -hmm. Big things tonight, big, it's big really things. It's really exciting to think That's that right. someone here tonight might not only be the next Miss California, but the next Miss USA, or even the next Miss Universe. That's right. The contestants involved in the Miss Universe organization come from small towns, big cities, and often start in local pageants held within their community. So in other words, you know, they start small and all of a sudden they get too big for you and, and won't give you their number and them. you can't even take all that, all that good stuff. At this time, we would like all local recruiters and staff to please stand and be recognized for your efforts in providing this opportunity for growth and activism throughout our state. Give it up for them. Thank you guys. 
Show the love. Show the love. Where is the love? Yeah, y'all didn't know I could sing, huh? Where is the love? Where is the love? Where is the love? Where is the love? All right, all right. I feel like I'm American Idol up That's here. That's why I didn't compete. Paul Abdul, American. where you at? Simon! Okay, now it's time for the most elegant part of the competition. This is also the most dazzling part of the competition. To most people, this is also the most beautiful part of the competition. So without further ado, this is the 2008 Miss California Teen USA Evening Gown Competition. <laughs> with Ventura County. Sipping rum 
reminiscing on days when I had a Mustang in my Greater face. San Diego. Up in the sky, bottle of champagne. Living my life in the best lane. I want to change by the glamorous. Flowers, the flowers, the glamorous. The glamorous, glamorous, by the glamorous. The flowers, the flowers. Mahogany. Ramon Valley. Gentlemen, your top 10 in the Miss California Team USA 2008. Thank you, ladies. Yeah! Man, I haven't so I can't believe, like, I get paid to do this. You know what I mean? Submit. Can, can you believe we get paid to have this much fun? We were getting paid for this? We getting paid. Something, at least I'm trying to get a few he dollars. Blew it. Times are, I can't even afford gas nowadays. We getting, we getting paid, right, Keith? All right, yeah, yeah. He said checks in the mail. All right, go ahead. You can read the rest because we're getting paid. Have we already welcomed all of our Miss Teen contestants back on the stage for one more look? <clears throat> no, we're not going to do that? All right, we're moving right along. You're exactly, you guys were exactly what my fantasy prom dates look like. Thank you for all the teen finalists. Thank you guys. Well, Sam, this is just the half of your fantasy, okay. literally. Because let's keep the beauty going with the 2008 Miss California USA evening gown what? presentation. Let's go. Oh, you. 
Now, ladies and gentlemen, it's our pleasure to present to you the top 10 Miss California evening gown competition. We start with Berkeley. I got problems up to here. I got people in my ear telling me these crazy things that I don't want. San Diego. Los Angeles. The clown is 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 the clown is
There they are, ladies and gentlemen, your top 10 for the title of Miss California 2008 evening gown competition. Thank you, ladies. I mean, Brittany, I gotta say, man, I don't know how you women do it. They had one day, they had to learn all the dancing, they had to look beautiful, like, it's I, I just have to give a shout out to Scott Grossman back there. Scott he works hard. An extraordinary man. Amazing. Amazing, I worked with him at Miss USA, and that man is just incredible. A round of applause Give for it Scott. up for Scott. Without Scott, there's no show, trust me. We would also like to bring up the house lights now. Bring them up, bring them up. So if you're asleep, it's time to wake up. And if you are a parent or a guardian to any of these contestants, will you please stand up? Come on, guys, stand up. You are the reason that we are here today. The pageant is a family commitment, and without family support, it would be nearly impossible for these girls to be here. Thank you, family members. That's right. Now I want to take this moment to personally say thank you for all the parents and families and our participants who have been with us all weekend. On behalf of K2 Productions, we thank you for your hard work, dedication, in raising these magnificent and beautiful women. Give a round of applause. But I do want to say another thing. If you want your daughters to continue to be successful, make sure they date great guys like me and Randy Wayne over there, yeah. and your dog, your dog, your dog, your dog, your dog. <laughs> We're gonna cut him off now, right. and let's welcome the executive producer of the Miss California USA pageant, Mr. The Man Himself, Keith Lewis. Bring your mouth, bring your mouth! Thank you, thank you so you much. You gonna do the soldier boy with me? <laughs> I, I was lucky, I, uh, I've had, the pleasure of working with both of you for three years. That's three right. Years. Yeah. Yeah. He so keeps veterans. You keep food on my table, man, and Brittany's table. We love you for Absolutely. that. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. uh, I just want to thank the sponsors because without them, uh, we couldn't put this on. Paul or Sean and Friends in High Places, Intuit Beauty, Murad Girl Extraordinaire, yeah. Hint Beverage Company, Kula Burrow, American Medical, As Medical Aesthetics. Mm -hmm. Sunstyle Tanning. I love them. Love them. Hair yeah. by Nico, yeah. hey, Michelle of Beverly Hills, Dr. Vic, Cinema Makeup School that kept all of these women beautiful tonight. Mm -hmm. Jiki, Cachet, the dresses and the Gorgeous. outfits in the opening Gorgeous. number. Uh, Dentney Shoes by Shane and Sean, Don Seidman and Jason Allen Photography. Yeah. KSA, which is a modeling agency. Uh, Hollywood Tans and Tanning Salon, Supermodels Unlimited, Twin Magic Lashes, Don Baker. The city Woo! of Los Angeles, yeah. thank you. The Orpheum Theater, where this great event is put on, the history here is amazing. The Miss Universe organization, I've got Trisha Langa wow. from Miss Universe here tonight. And if you haven't seen Pageant Place on MTV, try you and catch have it. To see it. That's oh right. my gosh. And I then of course well. my K2 staff and the volunteers. If anyone's out here, stand up, especially Andrea, Lily, Doug, Alex, Jill, Amy, Paula, Pat, Nancy, Mike, JJ, and the three Steves, and Jacques. They helped tonight. They put it on, and uh, without them, I wouldn't be able to do it. Uh, and my judges that we've kept here this weekend that have worked so hard because we keep them on a very fast schedule. Everybody got thanks tonight. I want to thank my baby mama's cousin, Renee, and all the other people, too. My baby mama, I love you, girl. <laughs> <laughs> we got to thank everybody, right, Keith? Absolutely. Uh, and I think I'm going to turn it back over to you, That's unless good. this is like fill time. I think it's probably fill time, but we'll fill time. Fill time. See, <laughs> fill time is when the judges are kind of uh, filling out the ballots and they're tabulating them and so forth, and it's when we get to just make uh, small talk. Mm -hmm. And I'm not good at that, so I'm going to leave Well, let it. me, since we're doing small talk, can I take over for a minute? Absolutely. Yeah. All right, I'm going like to tell you all what happened to me the other day. You know, the economy is really bad. This is a true story. I ain't trying to be funny. I was at Chevron pumping some gas, and you know, I, I see some homeless people that I know all the time, so I got love for the homeless. So they see me, yo, Sam, they be calling me like we friends. So I pump my gas, and I walk over to there, 
And the homeless guy walks over to me. You know, I see him all the time. And I reach in my pocket. He's like, yo, bro, you know, you're going to have to help me out today. I give him $5, right? And to me, that's cool, $5. And yeah. a lot of other people give him $5, it adds up. He looks at me like, what am I supposed to do with this? $5? I can't get nothing with it. I was like, wow, times are really bad right now. So appreciate being here. Appreciate everything. We're having a good time. We're going to keep it moving and just keep doing your thing. Mm -hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. That's it. Beautiful story. <laughs> Oh, we got more time? Do we have more time to kill? Still Judges, still adding stuff up? Oh, Lindsay Where Lohan, Britney about? Spears, they don't, want to get, they don't want me to get in all that. I'll get in trouble. If I start talking about all that, I'll get fired. Because all these, you know, young people are supposed to be role models, and, you know, they're doing all that crazy stuff. Mm -hmm. But what else? Come okay, on, I'll tell you a little bit about myself. I was Miss California USA 2005. That's right. Then Keep I, it up for it. Then I went on and I competed for Miss USA and I was second place. And this is kind of just to set no, the No, 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 you got to say that again. I don't think they heard that. So she competed and she was USA. second place. Come on, y'all. Give Like, that's amazing. She was first runner. That's a man. I, I bow down for that. Stop, stop. I know. I'm just dead serious. So anyway, long story short, usually women use this as a strong platform to go into the entertainment industry. There's modeling careers waiting for women who go through all this, and I chose instead to go to Africa, and I moved to Africa my after... My hometown, my hometown. <laughs> Give it up. I was Mr. Africa 2006, so I got my own crown. Can I get some love? Thank you very much, Mr. Africa. But the basic story, the principle of it all is that this opportunity gives women a great chance to look outside of themselves at what else is going on in the world. So I think we've got some huge pace setters behind us that are going to make it big, so be watching for them. That's right. It's all about being positive role models. Thank you. Woo! Man, the time has arrived to announce the top five. Would the teen finalists please join us back on stage? And they are here back on stage. Woo! Don't you guys love this, the anticipation? You guys are going to love this. Are you ready? Here we go. Our first finalist is Miss Ventura County Team. Woo! Our next finalist is Miss Napa County Team. Our third finalist is Miss Temecula Team. Our next finalist is Miss Belmont Team. That's you, girl. That's you. She was shocked. She couldn't believe it. Uh -huh. She's like, me? Oh, my goodness. Let's see. We've got room for one more. One more. We got to build it up. Build, we got to build it up. A little suspense. A little bit of suspense. Because, you know, every parent out there is like, it's going to be my baby. My baby. They about to call my baby name. So it's we got to. It's going to be Miss. <laughs> Benjamin Valley Team. Give it up. Congratulations to our top five for Miss California, Team USA 2008. <laughs> Ladies, it's time to really bring it right now. It's time to bring it, Brett. It is time to oh, bring it. It has already been brought because what? this okay. is the interview portion. Oh, man. They gotta have brains too, huh? They gotta have brains. Okay. Each contestant will be asked a personal question followed by a final judge's question. All right. 
Let's do it. Let's begin with number one. Okay, I'm just going to ask a question right now because I don't want to do anything wrong. Am I supposed to re be reading off of that teleprompter or this little card here? Because they're two separate questions. This one first. Got it. All right. Give her a round of applause. That's hard, man. Y'all, no, no, hold on, Brittany. Let me show you love. Y'all don't know how much stuff we have to memorize being up here. I know we look all cute and funny, but we got a million people talking. I got Donald Trump screaming over here, Keith screaming over here. So when we mess up, bear with us. And most of the time, it's not our fault because it's the teleprompter. Don't say that. It's what I'm saying. I'm just saying it's everybody. So. Okay, so the first question is, how was it having to compete in the swimsuit competition the day after Thanksgiving? Well, unfortunately, I had to keep my Thanksgiving dinner in moderation, but I would have to say that swimsuit was still pretty nerve-wracking out there. Thank you very much. It would be nerve-wracking for me, too. Downstage. <clears throat> Here you go, sweetie. No problem. She's got another question. We're gonna bring you right back up because we've got one more question for you. Woo! All right, judge number four, Ty Griffin asks, at what age do you believe that young girls should enter pageants? I really think that it's a personal decision and I don't believe that you should force anyone at any age to enter a pageant unless they would like to. And I have to say that I just joined this year and I couldn't be more grateful to be standing here today. Thank you. Right. Yeah. Next we have contestant number two. Thank you. So the question is, what was it like preparing for the pageant? It was actually really fun. I got to go to the gym and try all the new machines because we have a new gym in town and I got to start eating really healthy foods. My mom was packing me like celery with peanut butter in my lunch, and I actually really liked it, so I had a really good time. Great. Give it up for her. Our judge, Annie Roberts, would like to know what makes you a great role model. I feel that I'm a very good role model because I'm a leader at school, and I'm a leader in my town, and I feel like many girls my age have a hard time saying no to drugs and sex and drinking and alcohol, and I think that I know how to say no, and I feel like that's a very good thing, and I'm very proud of myself for it. She got morals. I love it. Mm -hmm. Morals. Thank you, contestant number two. Let's bring on down Miss Temecula team. Thank you. So why don't you tell us all about the most fun part of your weekend? I would have to say the funnest part was probably just meeting new girls because everyone here is just so awesome and it's a lot different than what people think it's going to be because they think there's going to be competition and, you know, stab people in the back. But everyone's really nice and I just love making new friends. Oh, that's cute. I like that answer. Awesome. Judge number two, Alexander Rivkin, would like to know what is the best way to protect the environment for the future? I think the best way to protect the environment for the future is by starting to use an alternative for our gasoline because I'm learning economics about alternatives and how it can really help the environment because it cuts back on the pollution in our society. And I really think it's important that we pay attention to that, especially since gas prices are pretty high. Huh. So I think that's the best way. <laughs> Say the least, right? <laughs> Amen. 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 Now let's meet contestant number four. Miss Beaumont team. So, first question, have you ever participated in a pageant before? Actually, this is my first pageant ever, and I'm so excited, and I'm so blessed to be here, and I couldn't have picked a better pageant to be in. <laughs> Judge Tammy Blake wants to know, <laughs> I like this one, would you rather be the President of the United States or an ultra pop star, like Paris Hilton says, so hot. Which one would you rather be? 
I probably would want to be the President of the United States because I feel that I'm a great role model and also if I was the President of the United States, I would, I, I would try to change the world, but then again, I would want to make people happy and I also would want to um, have more things for teenagers out there because we need a lot of support for the teenagers. And so go teens. <laughs> now there's someone that wants to win. I'd rather be a pop star. Thank you very much. Yeah. Come on down, final contestant. The final one. Give it up, y'all. The San Ramon Valley team. Thank you. All right, we want to know, what have you learned from being here this weekend? Well, I've learned many things from being here this weekend. I've met so many great girls, and I've learned that it's not all about just coming to win. And I knew that from the start, but it, it helped a lot because I met so many amazing, amazing women, had an amazing time, and it was really, really worth my time, and I've had an amazing experience, and I'm so blessed to be here. Thank you. Our judge number one, Miss Katie Blair, asks, what qualities do you look for in a best friend and why? Well, my best friend's actually here right now, and she has all the qualities that I would look for in a best friend. She, she can keep my secrets, she's bubbly, she's fun, she's like me, and we really get along and we can tell each other anything, and she's an amazing girl and I love her to death. Oh, yeah. Sweet, sweet. Thank you very much. Now our judges can get a final look at each final contestant to stand before us for Miss California, Teen USA 2008. We now present the final look. Ladies and gentlemen, our first finalist. Miss Ventura County Teen. Our second finalist. Miss Napa County Team. Next we have Miss Third finalist. Next we have Miss Temecula Team. Finalist. Come on down, Miss Beaumont Team. Fifth finalist. Next we have Miss San Ramon Valley Team. These are your five finalists for the title of Miss California Teen USA 2008. and final scores are being tabulated for the team. So why don't we welcome our top five in the Miss category. That's right, we're gonna narrow it down to one more time. I'm gonna do something wild and unpredictable now as I'm gonna go over here and get, oh, what do you have for me? Wow. <laughs> Surprise, we got an envelope. So now I'm gonna announce the top five finalists for Miss California USA 2008. Starting with, wow. Oh my gosh. First finalist is Miss Greta San Diego. Miss Barstow! 
followed by the judges. judges question. Let's begin with contestant number one, Miss Greater USA. <laughs> oh, you don't get to peek at that. Mm -mm. Just kidding, just kidding. <laughs> okay, your question is, what do you think California has to offer that other states may not? I would definitely say diversity. We are a state where we have so many different things to do. I mean, we have the mountains, the desert, we have the beaches where I'm from, San Diego, and um, I just think that we have so much to offer. Here in Hollywood, it's beautiful. In San Diego, we have Coronado. So I would just say we have such a diverse um, community here. Thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Well, judge number one, Mr. Ash Gupta, wants to know if you could be on the cover of any magazine which one would you choose and why? I would definitely say probably the new Miss California USA. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you, Miss Greater San Diego. Let's bring down contestant number two. Come on, come on down. <laughs> Thank you. So we want to know What's your family's favorite pastime in California? Well, I'm a Latina, so it's family picnics and barbecues and salsa dancing with the family. I have a big family, I love them very much, and they're here in their favorite pastime, support each other. Our beautiful judge, Laylene, wants to know, are you a leader or are you a follower? Oh, I am definitely a leader. I do not follow. I do what I want to do. And it's really important to follow your heart and your passion. And if you don't, you're going to be left behind. I'm on top and I'm in front. Oh, wow. 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 OK. Wow. Thank you. Let's bring down Miss Barstow, USA. Wow. Got a few fans in the house. Couple of fans. So we want to know what is your favorite place to visit in California? My favorite place to visit, I actually come from the desert, so my favorite place to visit is the beaches. <laughs> it's a nice, refreshing way to relax and go out and have a good time with my family and my friends. Thank you. And judge number five, Mr. Rick Enriquez, wants to know if a magical wand could remove any difficulty from your life, would you wave it and why? Actually, no, I wouldn't. I am a sole believer that everything happens for a reason. And if I uh, have a difficult time in my life, it has only made me stronger. And I am prouder to be where I am today because of those hard times in my life. Thank you. Yeah. All right, let's meet finalist number four. Miss Palace Verdes, USA. That's right. So we would like to know, how would you describe California to someone that has never been to California? Well, I'll echo what was said by Miss Greater San Diego, that I think that the strength of our state is the diversity. And as a biracial Californian who's half Caucasian and half Chinese, I think that that is something that we really should be proud of. And so I would describe it as a diverse place, not just geographically in terms of beaches and valleys, but in terms of the great people that are in the state. All right. <laughs> Judge Francine Champagne wants to know, 
Who in this world inspires you? Where do you get your inspiration? I would have to say I get all my inspiration from the incredible women in my family, many of whom are sitting up in the balcony, because I think that they've been trailblazers. And my mom went to law school when it was only 10% women in law school, and now I'm, I'm in law school and continuing on. So I think I have a lot of powerful women, and they've taught me to lead and be a strong woman, and that's where I am today. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Our last finalist, Miss Woodland Hill. Yeah. That was a hard pick, huh? Oh, no, gosh. <laughs> we want to know, what do you like best about the city that you are representing tonight? Well, I'm representing Woodland Hills. I've lived there for over a year now, and the best part about it is there's no traffic. <laughs> there's lots to do in Woodland Hills. It's a little farther out. It's a great community, and I'm very proud to represent it tonight. Thank you. Yeah. Our judge number three, Randy Wayne, wants to know, what do you feel is the best way to deter our youth from joining gangs? The best way is through education. And unfortunately, I believe that our educational system is a little bit lenient nowadays. We cannot overlook anything. Our youth is our tomorrow, and our teachers need to teach that it's important for these kids to grow up and be leaders and be strong and be great role models because they're running our world in no time. You can't blink nowadays because tomorrow there are leaders. So I think education is key and best of luck to them. Thank you very much. All right. Thank you. All right now judges, here's a final look at each of the top five that stand before us for the title of Miss California USA 2008. Breathe for a moment and this take these, one of these contestants will be the next Miss California USA. Finalist number one. Miss Greater San Diego USA. Woo! Finalist number two. Miss Los Angeles, USA. Finalist number three. Finalist number four. Miss Palace Verdes, USA. Number five. Well, as we get ready to announce the new title holders, we need to say thank you and farewell to our reigning title holders. Thank and here you they are, ladies five. and gentlemen, your five finalists for the title of Miss California 2008. One of these ladies will be your new Miss California. Thank you, ladies. As we were saying before, it's time to finally say farewell to our reigning title holders. So please, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome Kylie Lynn. Miss California Teen USA for her final walk. Give it up for her. Since the seventh grade, 
I have lived my life with the words of Henry David Thoreau planted firmly in my mind. Live the life you have imagined. As a little girl, I always imagined myself walking red carpets and signing autographs. Never did I imagine so many of my dreams would come true this year. Not only was I able to enjoy the glitz and glamour of Hollywood events, but I also was able to use my title to benefit causes that I'm really passionate about. I hope through my many volunteer hours, I was able to inspire young girls to always believe in themselves and to realize that beauty truly comes from within. There were so many times this past year, I felt as if my life were one of those MasterCard commercials, and mine would go a little something like this. One shiny crown, $250. One sparkly sash with my state's name on it, $200. One fabulous appearance wardrobe, $3,000. Being Miss California Teen USA 2007, priceless. Thank you to everyone who was part of this incredible journey. You will all be forever ingrained in my heart. I'm so grateful for the time I spent being Miss California Teen USA 2007. Thank you, Kylie, for this year of service you have given to the state of California. Let's give one more round of applause. Give it up, y'all. Give it up. Now, ladies and gentlemen, please welcome all our contestants to the stage. Bring them out, bring them out. Come on, y'all, give it up for them. Ladies and gentlemen, a nice round of applause, please, for all our contestants competing for the title of Miss California, Miss California Team. Yeah! What an incredible experience we've had this weekend. Thank you, ladies. Congratulations on a job incredibly done. You guys look amazing. Now, I know when you guys get home, your parents are going to tell you that you're all winners. But seriously, from me and Brittany, you guys are all winners, and I've been here three years, and I gotta say, y'all were off the hook. So let's give it up for them, y'all. Come on! Yeah! Who's gonna have a big slice of cheesecake with chocolate drizzled on top tonight? Yeah. See, after, after this, all the stress is over, y'all can get a DJ party, have fun. Yeah! Oh, thank you. I think it's a really difficult decision. The judges are still debating. It's a tough one. That's right, guys. Hold on. We back now? What a roller coaster this year has been. It's had many ups, downs, and all arounds, but let me tell you, this has by far been the best roller coaster I have ever been on. I can't believe I was a part of such a historical moment last year, as I am the fourth African American to win the title Miss California USA, Woo! and the first African American woman to win succeeding another African American woman. What a mouthful, but that's heading to the history books. Though this year has been great, I could not have done it without some amazing people. A huge thank you goes to God, K2 Productions, and to all of my lovely sponsors, including the one and the only Intigems. I can't forget my amazing family, and of course, my fantastic parents, Fred and Sheila Tandy. To my successor, believe it, conceive it, receive it. That's my motto, it's helped me, let it help you, good luck this year. Though my year is over and done with, there is nothing to be sad about, but everything to be grateful for. But hey, don't worry, this is not the last you will see of me. I assure you, I am just getting started. Your 2007 Miss California USA, Megan Tandy. That's right. 
Rachel. That's my Megan Sandy. Ladies and gentlemen, Megan Tandy. The reigning Miss California 2007. Miss Megan, Megan Sandy. Sandy. Megan, you have represented to us, and we thank you so much for all your hard work and dedication as the state representative. We love you, Megan. All right, now is the moment that you all have been waiting for, the announcement of the 2008 title holders. Woo! Before that, um, let's have a little award ceremony now, if we may. I feel like... Uh, Giving out a few awards. Before Probably gonna we... go have to get that little award envelope. My feet are killing me and I'm not walking. All right, step. all right, all right. I'm serious. I don't know how these girls I haven't been wearing heels since I've been out. My feet are killing me. Like I'm sweating just because they're hurting so bad. Okay. I'm serious. I'll trade anyone out there your feet. The awards come out from that side. What is it? Sam's gonna get the uh, our special envelope and I'm gonna peek. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Wow. You guys are going to like it. Huh? They didn't give me it. You need the We're getting it together, folks. Hang in there. We got to give out some awards, but first we got to get the awards. So that's what we're trying to do right now is get all the awards. So before we announce our winners, we have some special awards for the non-finalists that are now going to give, that we're going to give to the contestants who are not in the top 15. Our first award, awards are for the highest scores in the preliminary competition. So our non-finalist team highest swim so, swim, uh, swim suit award or goes to... Miss Westlake Village Team Jenna Mitchell. Our non finest teen highest evening gown score goes to. Miss Rancho Santa Fe team, Jacqueline Rofile. Give it up for her. Where you at? Congratulations. Woo! Our non finalist team with the most outstanding interview and highest interview score goes to. Miss Valencia team, Jacqueline Frankusian. Yeah. And now let's continue with our Miss special award winners. Our non-finalist Miss Highest Swimsuit score goes to Miss La Mesa Christina Johnson. Yeah. Our non-finalist Miss Highest Evening Gown score goes to Miss San Francisco, Carol Chen. Where you at? Carol. Woo! You do? Our non-finalists. Miss Teen with the most outstanding interview and the highest score goes to Miss Malibu, Nana Merriweather. <laughs> Our 
Awards are very fun, as you guys can see, and our next two awards are very, very special. These awards serve as a huge honor and cannot be disputed in any fashion because they are voted on by the contestants. The 2008 Miss California Teen USA for Miss Congeniality goes to Orange County Teen Corp and Bearsley. The 2008 Miss California USA Congeniality Award goes to Los Angeles, Christina Silver. All right, so check it out. Our final award goes to the most photogenic contestant. And basically, that's the girl that you want to take to your prom so 20 years later, you could brag to all your rich business friends. You know what I'm saying? Because at least you had to find girl. So that goes to Miss Teen Photogenic goes to Rancho Santa Fe Teen Jacqueline Rafelman. Yeah, where you at? The 2008 Miss California USA Photogenic Award goes to Palms Kellen O'Connor! Where you at? Kylie Lynn and Megan Candy have really demonstrated what it means to be Miss California Teen USA and Miss California USA. They spent the year doing some good creative change and would please like to welcome them both back to the stage as they crown the new representatives. Let's go! That's right, the time is now, and this is the crowning moment. Brittany and I were gonna perform a song for As Good As It Gets, but you know, she got scared and ran. Oh, you back now? Okay, okay. I just needed a candy. Oh. I promise that's what Did it you was. get me one? No, you can get one. You in the always, back. I mean, I always have your back. You always think about yourself. Where are we? Right here. We reading the final results? That's right. Okay, so. I'm gonna open this little purple envelope right now. Ladies, good luck. Here we go. You got, hold on, hold on, hold on. Are y'all ready? Are you guys ready? I see your parents are ready, but are you guys ready? Our fourth runner up, Miss Napa County. Give it up for her. Our third runner-up, Miss San Ramon. Our second runner-up, Miss Temecula. All right, y'all. Woo! This is what I love. This is the moment I love. We're about to call the name of the first runner-up. Now, if the new title holder is not able to fulfill her duties as Miss California Teen USA, the first runner-up will assume the position as Miss California Teen USA. You ladies ready? Yeah, I'm ready. You wanna just wait a few more minutes? The first runner up is Miss Beaumont Team USA and the winner is Miss Ventura County.
take your walk. The new Miss Teen California USA. Is that amazing or what, guys? Now it is time to announce the finalists for Miss California 2008. Our fourth runner up is Palace Birdies! Nervous. Nervous, B. B, I'm nervous. Man, it's winning time right now. Our third runner up is Miss Greater San Diego. I feel like Kobe in the fourth quarter right now. I'm just shaking, you know what I mean? I feel like Kobe, I know, you too? I feel like Kobe, Shaq, everybody in the fourth quarter. All right, our second runner up is Miss Barstow. <laughs> Woo! It's getting hot in here. Are you guys nervous? <laughs> Woo! <sighs> Got girls, I need you guys in the center. I know, I know. Breathe, just breathe. This is the moment you guys have been waiting for your whole life. Our first runner up. For Miss California 2008 is Miss Woodland Hill! Your new Miss California USA 2008. Los Angeles. You did it, girl! You did it! You're the new Take Miss your California walk USA. for the new Miss California USA. Don't lose that crown. We invite the parents of our new Miss California team and the new Miss California USA to the stage for a photo at the end of our show. We also ask that the parents pick up their daughters outside in the parking lot alley to the left of the stage after the show. Congratulations, ladies and gentlemen, and good night. Thank you for being part of our show. See you next year! Yeah! Give it up for all of our contestants one last time! Woo! That concludes Miss California USA and Miss Teen California USA 2008. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen, and once again, drive safely. Good night.